content. So the last few weeks we started our sparring, um, circuits and everything else, the technique, everything that we've been working on, um, pre-sparring, all the technique stuff has been used in, in the actual sparring session. So everything we've been working on practicing is, is coming out and it's all part of the game plan for, for the night. Um, and also the strength and conditioning, Obviously, I'm, I'm known on having a great engine and being super strong, super fit. That's gone on to the next stage of now, and uh, down here working with Andrew Langford, um, Carnegie School of Sport, excellent facilities, which I've seen this opportunity to say thank you to Peter McCree for backing us and supporting us. Really developing his strength back up, and I think I think we're right back up where we were before, and maybe even getting above that. So obviously the next phase now, just going to be getting as strong as possible, as powerful as possible, getting ready for that next fight. The tickets have been flying out. It's, it's it's been a, a crazy response, and um, you know sometimes. You, you worry a little bit. Certainly, I've never been beaten in, in, uh, in 11 years and 35. It's always been, a oh, well done, Josh, will beat the next one. And obviously, after getting knocked out in, in the last fight, you worry um, if people are going to still support. And obviously, I had loads, loads of messages, um, phone calls asking how I am and stuff. But people are showing the support by paying their added money and by buying tickets and, and, and making some, themselves uh, present. The show they're going to be there, and they're, they're all people are coming from all over the country to be honest with you. And it takes me back a little bit. I'm, um, if anything, it gives me a massive motivation. Like I said, today's been a tough day. I was sparring early this morning, I've come in, done the tough session there, and uh, a little bit tired. But mentally, you, you're constantly thinking about those people who are going to be there in the night time, and it just definitely does give us a drive. So it's going to be a hell of an atmosphere um, come September 4th, and you know, compared to February 13th for badly anybody there. Mauricio is going to be walking into something completely different and uh, I can't wait for it.